Hey guys, my name is Sediak and welcome back to another episode of The Tenants where guys, whew, last episode we were fighting bankruptcy to the point where we kind of managed to kind of get things rocking and rolling. Our game plan right now is to constantly make sure that we have enough, hold on, hold on, hold on, uh, to pay our bank loan. The next one is due in 23 days, 7 grand, and then in 25 days, 17 grand. Big monies, but it did enable us to buy our property, so we can't be too mad, even though I am mad because, you know, it's too much money. But as the bubs are going on, we are slowly paying off this one to the point where we will eventually be able to pay it off. Currently, we are making a loss of 3900 on the old monthly balance. But what we're going to do... Oh, we got a message. What we're going to do, let me just quickly pause it, is we are going to stay in the slums. Well, I say stay in the slums. We're going to let everybody in the slums currently uh, end their tenancy so we can get someone new in. So that's why we can make some more money. But I'm going to slowly kind of go around revamping all the um, the buildings and the places in the slums. Uh, somebody said in the comment section uh, in last episode that the reason I didn't get as much money for the, the building in the suburbs uh, is because sometimes adding in too many rooms can in such a small area can be a negative effect because they like big open rooms. So I think once that tenancy is kind of completely up, I'm going to redo that building for the 10th gazillionth time and make it a little bit more open plan and beautiful. Now, if you guys are enjoying the tenants and want to see more, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you're out there and hit it, make sure you do subscribe so you are notified that next episode does come out. Now, we had a message, but I don't know what it is. Oh, I just sent you the overdue money. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Let's get rid of all of them. So we've got 21,000 in the bank. So I think what the game plan is right now is we're actually going to travel to the suburbs because doing the jobs in the suburbs make us the most amount of money. Now, every time our agent in the slums messages us and go, hey, there's a tendency about to go up for renewal. Would you like me to renew it? And I'm going to say no. We're going to let it go. So then once that property is then vacant, we can then renovate it, make it a little bit more beautiful and uh, hopefully make a little bit more cash money moolah. So the property in question right then, if I go to it right now, we are making... I mean, compared to this one, four and a half grand, nearly three grand. If I go to this property, how do I get to it? Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> it's like I've forgotten how to play the game all over again. Uh, this one over here. Right, what I've done is I've tried to cram in, oh my goodness me, as many um, rooms as possible, and it looks so overcrowded. You've got one, two, three, four, five rooms. We're going to redo this and make it a little bit more open plan. Uh, once that tenancy is up, in the hopes that we can then eventually make a little bit more cash. Now, as of right now, we actually have all the money that's needed to pay off our bank loans when they're due. So, we can spend the current time right now then trying to make some extra cash. Money. Mola. So, agents, very poor bishop. Yep, we'll always try and look after one as we're ticking along. Because, um, you know, it, it, it's, it's just like free money in many ways uh bethany potts has just messaged me one of the leases about uh, oh there we go okay i'll handle it myself there we go i'll handle it myself so that's the first one that can go up for for renewal because what normally happens is when you renew a tenancy they always come in cheaper oh, oh no i clicked off they always come in cheaper than what you originally had it so you you kind of you have to kind of constantly micromanage getting rid of them and getting somebody new in, because it also gives you the chance to kind of renovate the property too and make it a little bit better. So that's kind of what we got to think of. What is going on here? We have cracks on invisible walls. That makes no sense. What is this? Is that a oh that's a refrigerator? I'm gonna try and restore it and then we'll try and sell it. Well, not sell it. Steal it for ourselves. <laughs> there is legit an invisible wall there. What is going on, Uncle? You are plastering the invisible. <laughs> That's a John Cena wall if I've ever seen one in my life. Right. Um, add it to my figure me jig. Where's the exit? It's over here, isn't it? Get out of here, boy. I got stuffs to do. Stuffs to do. Right, what's it going to be then? So, yeah, I want to exit the premises. Um, begin renovation. It's going to be an audio room, bathroom. Okay, so we need a bathroom, a ba bathroom and a, ba and a bathroom? What is this? Oh, it, this is what we built last time, wasn't it? It's it's basically, um, 
It's basically like a furniture store. Re it's really weird. It really is. But I build it. Right, we do the bathrooms just here. Doorways, bam, bam. And then move the heater just to... Oh, no, that's not the rotate button. It's like I played this game the other day when I did my last episode, and already I feel like I've forgotten all the buttons. All the buttons. Uh, doors, then. Bam, bam! And then we'll sort the bathrooms out first. So, walls are yellow in this one. Laminate flooring. Wabam. Walls are blue in this one. Floors are tiles. Wabam. They want those sweet, sweet toilets. Wabam. They want those sweet, sweet bathroom sinks. Which, on boy, is going no expense spared right now on the bathroom situation. Then we got those expensive toilet brushes. And then we got those expensive toilet paper holders. Well, bam! There we go. <laughs> Two bathrooms, now done. So this is the interesting one. Uh, with a sense of, like, it's just so much stuff. It's just so much stuff. It is, like, legit a furniture store. So walls are yellow. Let's go for this wall. There we go. Make it a little bit more brighter. Concrete flooring. Bam. Funky. I like it. Can we not do the outside? Maybe not. Maybe not. So, okay. We'll try and do this methodically or, or whatever. Uh, how much have I got remaining? 19,000. So, let's go Let's go for these tables here. So, it is a furniture store. So, we got to treat it as if it was a furniture store. I think, actually, we'll start with wardrobes. How many is that I need to do? If I put one there. Let me move this. Um, there. Um, so this is stuff that will go against it. So TVs, audio systems. Do you know what? I don't think it really matters, to be honest with you. So it is like a furniture store. So if I go like, bam. Put tables like this in the center. Oh, do you know what I should have been doing? Different tables. Because if it is a furniture store, they want to experience different tables, don't they? And all of a sudden, that table is so is so small. But we're giving the customers options. Giving them options right now. So then we'll incorporate um, coffee tables here. A little bit of everything. A DVD player we can throw on top of... Oh, we can use the tables to put stuff on. That's actually pretty cool. So two DVD players. Buy our DVD players, please. Uh, a refrigerator here. A refrigerator here. Um, we've got the kitchen hood. Would you like to buy a kitchen hood? We'll give you good deals. Good deals. Good. I mean, oh my goodness me, that's like an industrial one, isn't it? All right, bam. I'm just taking your money for this period. So wait. Money coming in for days. All right, buy. Oh, that's a new blender. That's a new blender right there. A toaster. Hadn't seen that blender before. So, cookers, how much have I got remaining? Okay, still quite a bit of cash. Is That's a new stove. Oh, snap. Right, we've de we definitely got... Is that a new microwave? My mind is blown. No, that kettle's the same kettle. Kitchen scales. Uh, washing machines live longer with kettle gone. If you're from the UK right now, you you know all about that. Um, <laughs> right, throw them in. Audio systems. I think your tenant uh, started to cook. Wait, what? Um, started to cook meth in the unit. I'm not sure what to do about this. There's nothing going. There's nothing wrong going on there. Do I get an extra? Do I get extra money? I don't know. Look at the money you just sent us. Damn. Damn. Um, or do I get a do or do I get a split of the money? I don't know. Sound system. Oh, do you know what? Sat I never placed these in. I never placed. Oh, damn! We got them new speakers, boy. Them new new speakers. Right, TVs. Obviously, place that one on the wall. 
How much have I got left then? Is that the last thing I need to get in? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. What was that? What was that? So, do I have to pay you protection now? Hold on! Hold on. Hold on. Hold okay, have I done everything, by the way? There there's something going on. Right, DVDs. Right, I'm going to scrap that. Deliver job. Right, first... First, send the uncle in right away. Oh, I don't know whether that was the uh, the babysitting job. But two, it is Corey Wu. Where is Corey Wu? And what does she look like again? Did she, there she is. In a Sonic Hill. What's happened? Why am I moving so slow? Oh, yes, because my uncle's doing that. <laughs> Hilarious. Um, right, properties. Is she legit cooking meth? Corby Wu. Did she pay me protection money? I think she did. Holy smokes. All right, it's working again. Yeah, you now pay me. I'm now. I'm now I am the danger. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. But Masonic Hill Road, which is this place here. Somebody's leaving very soon. So I can renew the tenancy, make this place a little bit nicer, a little bit better, which is all good. And taking care of tenants over there. All good. And another message. Just send me the money. Sweet. 40 grand in the bank. Holy smokes. Okay, we're doing pretty good right now. So, okay, while we wait for other tenancies to end, there was a really difficult one here. You're going to get 9,200 from completion. Let's get this done. And I'm hoping by the time we've got this done, we have a lot of people who have vacated our properties. So we can then, um, you know, get some new peeps in, do some renovations, make some extra money. That's what we're thinking. That's what we're kind of hoping for right now. That is what we're kind of hoping for right now. Um, 15 days, 17 days. So we still got plenty of time. We, there's no stress, guys. I'm not stressing. You're stressing. But I really do. I really do hope in the next update that they um, add in the ability to fast forward when your uncle's doing work. Because why can I fast forward to everything, but I can't fast forward to this damn folio right now, fixing stuff. Well, I'm adding that to my storage. Clean. Then get out of here, old man. But the fact that my budget is 28,000 shows that this is going to be c -c 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 crazy. Crazy right now. Right, get out of here, boy. Begin the renovation. So, bedroom, kitchen, bathroom, living room, garden. You got a pack of rats in there? Oh, we're sending a pro. Is this to do with this one? Where is it? It is. I kind of always forget. Right, leave me alone. One, two, three, four rooms I've got to build. So build mode then. We'll do one. We'll do two. Three. Four. There we go. Beautiful. So a door, a door. A door. And a door. I could have just cut across there, but I'm kind of making the hallway slightly a little bit bigger too. Um, doors themselves then. There we go. And we'll start with the living room. So the living room is going to be here. Is where we'll have it. So they want that midnight blue wallpaper. That beautiful pink carpet, which looks terrible. Uh, they want a big beautiful TV on the wall. Bam. They want a little bit of a shelf. So can I put the DVD player on the shelf there? I could pull it on top. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Uh, couch, we'll go for this one. And then we'll get a nice little armchair in. There we go. 
living room done. Bathroom, which will have the bathroom just here. I'll move this out of the bathroom. Put the heater in the living room, make it nice and toasty. Walls brown. We'll give them a nice brick. There we go. And we'll get the big, beautiful bathtub in the center. Shower cabin on the corner. Where we should get on this corner. Nice. We'll get the toilet in. We'll get the bathroom sink. I'm going to go for this one. Put it like there. So I can get a nice, beautiful wash machine just there. They want that toilet paper? Oh, yeah. Okay, someone's left that property. There's only one dude remaining in there, I believe. Uh, plunger. There we go. Towel rack. Just there. That is done. That is done. So now we'll move on to the kitchen, which we'll treat this as being the kitchen right now. So walls yellow. I'm looking for this style. Hardwood floor. See, that's actually quite nice. I like it. I like that style. I like it a lot. So kitchen cabinet then. And we'll actually let me go for the sink first. We'll go this sink. If I start this right in the corner, then kitchen cabinet. Bam. 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 Uh, the cooker at the very end. Bam. And then the fridge. Oh, that's a nice kitchen. That's a nice that's a real nice kitchen. Kitchen equipment will get in a toaster. And that is done. That is done. Okay, what was that problem we had just here? Oh, thanks for helping me solve the problem. Gotcha. Gotcha. Right, bedroom. Let's get this sorted real quick. So we'll go for this type of wall first. Hardwood floor. They want a single bed in here. How much have I got remaining? 7,000. So I can spend the money on this bed. Right, let's get a, a beautiful little desk in. Right, we could do this actually quite cool right now. So spin this right round. Get this right against there. TV. Have I got enough for this TV? So I want this TV on the wall. There we go. Uh, laptop. We'll go for the cheaper laptop just there. Because I know I'm going to be cutting into my funds right now. And then the big boy desk chair right there. That is done. Then it's just a garden. I got like pennies to do the garden with. <laughs> right, garden hose. All right, there we go. The grill. I got to go cheap and cheerful. We got, got uh, decoration. Oh, okay. So we have to go for the $70 ones. Tree. Okay, so bam, 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 bam. That is all the trees. I've managed to do it with $87 remaining. <laughs> That's what happens when you always try and go for the most expensive stuff. But there we go. That is done. That wasn't too bad. That was not too bad. So we should get we should get a good review for that. Because I felt like, I mean, the kitchen, it's, the kitchen itself sells that house. Even if I do say so myself. Even if I do say so myself. So we completed that one. They skedaddle out of here. We should end this one then with over 50 grand in the bank. Once they have finished up. Can we get any more babysitting jobs? No, no. No, I can't. Right, this person finished yet? Here we go. Bam! 53,000 in the bank, boys. 53,000. What was my review on that? I'm interested. It was five stars. Yes. Okay, 11 grand. Nice. So we are having a vacancy. Okay, that was an important message. We have a vacancy now over here, but I'm not sure how long until she... Um... Hmm. Oh, now she got a problem. Um, sure, why not? Why not? 
Uh, where is she then on this one? She is... So I'm losing money on Bory Lane. Oh, that's because someone's left, hasn't it? Um, okay, so... Next payment then. I can spend a 1000 to kind of lose her. Now, if I did that, i got to think about it logically. How this is going to work. Now, would I get more money... The prestige is B. Would I get more money if I got rid of the door here to make this a big open room? Hmm. Right, I've broken the agreement on our drug dealer. <laughs> broken it. And I've got... It's a prestige B. 64 is the skill level. Begin renovation. So I just want to see what would happen if I just demolished... Okay, I can't demolish it because of uh, what's going on. Move you over. Move you over. Demolish! Right, just by doing that, I want to see if I ever... 64... 59. No, okay. That doesn't work out that well. <laughs> you damn folio. Okay, I, I, it makes sense. It could be that I got two bedrooms that are really reducing it. But it is what it is. At the end of the day, it is what it is. Right, let's just make this place a little bit nicer. That's really all I've got to do. Oh, no, I need to just put a doorway there. <laughs> get, a, get a freaking door in, boy. So walls. I just got to make this one nice. It's the red one. The red wall. There we go. So, let's do stuff then. So, furniture-wise, we're going to get rid of this bath. And place the new bath in. Really, really expensive one. There we go. Um, it has a couple of mirrors in here, which is fine. Not really much we can kind of do about that. Um, for the kitchen, we do have... The ability to get... Wasn't there a new stove? Or was that only for what I was kind of building in that other place? I think it was. Yeah, I think it was. Right, living room then. We've got that sofa in there. Like, how much... Why can't I make this any much nicer than what it is? Does the bedrooms need... I don't know. Caputis in? I'm going to sell you. Sell you. Is that the one thing I don't have in the, in the in here? Isn't it? Is a computer set up? So I'll throw this in. Get the little gaming chair in. There we go. So just from what I've done right now, that is a it's a sixty five. Okay. Uh, hang on. Hold on. How do I? No, you can't really see much from it, can you? I'm trying to think what the best option would be for this. We have a Rhine rack. I feel like I've, fa I've thrown in so much fancy stuff. Is it the fact that I've got a double bedroom? Hmm. I don't really want to... I mean, I might have to get rid of the double bedroom. But I feel like it flows perfectly. Like, what more could they want? Right, let me go to furniture. Um, I, I feel like I've thrown... Is it, is it too cluttered? Is that the problem? Living room, bathroom, kitchen, bedroom. Um, bathroom. Dining room could be an option. We don't really have a dining room. So what if I turn this bedroom over here into a dining room? I know then I'm, only get, I'm getting rid of one tenant, but if I can get big money... If I can make it to the point where... Now, this is going to be really weird at the fact that the dining room is going to be over on this side. It is going to be really weird. Okay, but just just, just, just roll with it. Right, everywhere can be... Okay, not everywhere can be approached. Sell you. How do I cancel this? There we go. 
Um, does that work instead? No? Okay. Delete. Um, okay, so if I've got a dining room area now in, 61. Oh, is it, I don't think because the dining room can be used yet, can it? Dining room. Okay, maybe not use these chairs. All right, if I put that right against it here. Okay. 64. So it's pretty much the same prestige if I add a dining room there. Right, now, okay, so now I know that, we are now going to delete, and then bulldoze that, so then leave, brings it down to a C, when you make that room a bit bigger. Is there, is there too much stuff in here? Is that the problem? Because I don't quite get it myself. How I can make other places beautiful. Do I just have too much stuff in this place? Is that what it is? It could be. So... Oh, I could change the bed in, in this one as well. I spent so much money on this place to not improve it. 59. Right, let's just sort it out then. Because it's kind of it's kind of annoying me now. It really is. So, if I just sort the walls out. And over here it's this one. And I'm just adding the furniture now to finish off this bedroom. And then it is what it is at the end of the day, okay? Right. Big one just there. Spin you round. Little bedside table there. Nice little lamp just there. And yeah. It is what it is, isn't it? Not more I can really do. To be honest with you. So I'm gonna leave it like that. It's B63. It is what it is. Now, do you reckon I'll get more money? Oh hang on, I'm renovating again. Do you reckon I'll get more money doing a single person living here? Because they have the option of having two rooms. You know what I mean? I want to see what I can get for this with one person. So if I was to negotiate... Oh my good god. I can! I'm getting more money for a single person here. Oh, this is oh wow! Look at that stuff. That's a cool cooker. Integrated. Oh no! Everyone's gonna moan out now. There's a freaking earthquake going on. Right, hold on, guys. Just sending you the money, sweet. Uh, I handled it myself. Uh, I said it a pro. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. We have an elite contract, which I will accept. But I know I'm losing a lot of money right now. But guys, where is it? Six thousand. Turning that into a single occupancy with two bedrooms has made me so much money, <laughs> so much money right now. So even though there's a, there's a vacancy available, damn, he rented the whole apartment. He rented the whole apartment. Right, sweet, send me the money, sweet, sweet, sweet. Let me get rid of all this stuff, because i got to do this. So we'll get this out of the... Oh, my good God. What? Please tell me I can repair some of this furniture, because I want to keep it for myself. Clean, repair. Right, uncle. I pray to you right now. Repair this stuff. Because I want to hold on to that. I didn't quite do that. But then again, I bet you they're going to want to um, have that stuff themselves in this room. I'm salvaging it all because this is stuff that I can't buy.
Right, I'm now going to run around and do every single one of them right now. Which is good. So I'll check the messages while he does that. So let's what you Okay, I had it myself. Don't worry about that. Okay, I'll leave it. It's up to you. You're the boss. Damn right. Damn right, Bethany. Right, so we've got 25,000. I, I bet you they, they're going to want that stuff, aren't they? I bet you they're going to want it, so not much I can do about that. The garden's actually quite nice, isn't it? I like it. So, begin renovation. Fur rug. Yeah, they're going to want that stuff. Okay, I'll see what I can get away with and what I can actually keep for myself. So, it's a bedroom, bathroom, kitchen, living room. Gotcha. So, build them. We'll do a... A bedroom there. I'll do a bathroom there. Where's the back door? It's over there. Do a kitchen here. And we do the most awkward living room ever here. Unless I do it like that. There we go. Roll with it. <laughs> this is kind of awkward, but we'll take it. There we go. We get a nice little section there for the for the living room. So doors before I, I I forget. Nice, and then we'll start then with the bathroom. So walls are grey, floors are tile. They want a a big beautiful bathtub in here, which I put just there. We'll get the toilet in. And the shower cabin. So the shower cabin is going to be a little bit awkward. It is going to cover the window slightly. Not much I can do about that. Bathroom sink. We get the washing machine. So the toilet paper. Toilet brush. Uh, where do I put the towel rack here? Towel rack. Oh, new plunger. And then finally, one of the new mirrors. Right, looks like one of my tenants is up for lease. One of my leases up for tenants. Uh, one of them. I'll handle it myself, please. Bathroom now done. So then we'll do the bedroom over here then. Bedroom. Single bed. All right, just in the corner. Walls. They really want it to look like a, a hunting cabin, don't they? Bam. How much have I got remaining? Okay. All right. Desk. Desk chair. Hunting trophy. All right, they can be all fish. And maybe we'll have one with a boar head. And a fur rug. I want to go for this one because I get to keep the other really expensive ones. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. I can get away with keeping some stuff. Right, kitchen then. Walls are grey. Oh, that's an, I like that floor. I like that floor a lot. Um, kitchen cabinet then. So, hold on. Where's the... Did it need a sink? A kitchen sink. Um, right, we'll go with this one. Uh, kitchen cabinet, which would that? Oh, do you mean? Wait, where's that little blue one gone? Well, we're gonna have to go for this one, unfortunately. Oh, they want a couple of kitchen cabinets. It's an awkward sink, but it is what it is. Uh, teapot, and then a fire pit. Interesting, with a beautiful little fridge. Nice. Right, good stuff then. And then, finally, the living room. Oh, the living room. Okay, it's a good job we've got this awkward... The awkwardness going on. Because, you yeah, know. Wait, what are they classing as living room? Oh, I don't know. Because, uh, um... There's a lot of stuff, by the looks of it. So, a couch... We'll go for this one. Pull it just there. We've got a shelf. 
Let's spin that back around again. Armchair. Ooh, okay, we'll go for this. There we go. Fireplace. As I say, it wasn't rotating them. Firewood. Right in front of the fireplace, because that is, you know, that's not dangerous, is it, guys? This this room is so awkward, I can't really do much with it, unfortunately. But we'll put the boar head above the fireplace. Fur rug, again. I get to keep the, all the, like, the animal ones. Trophy. Give him a little medal. A dummy gun. I want two of those. I got... 1,500 remaining. A clock. Put on the fire piece there. Wall cabinet. See, that will go amazing above. They can bang their head on that. <laughs> I'm against hunting, so I don't really want to make this too nice. Oh, look at this dude! Look at this dude right now! He be looking like the mayor. He do be looking like the mayor right now. I believe it is the mayor. Could it be the mayor again? Are we doing the mayor's house all over again? He's now decided he wanted to go hunting. I have a feeling so. I have a feeling so. Right, get out of here. Get this done. Because I got tenancies to renew. I got tenancies to renew. All right, we've paid one of our debts. The other one's going to be coming out very soon. There we go. There goes that one. That's now done. So your boy has 35,000. It looks like it didn't move, but I just paid 17,000 out uh, for that loan. So, which is pretty much the loan I just paid out. So that's actually quite, quite cool. There. Okay, okay, sweet, sweet, sweet. So right now we're losing 12,000 a month and that's because a lot of our tenancies have now disappeared and skedaddled out of here so when we look at vacancies here you have no vacancies at the moment in the suburbs we have two available in uh, the slums so we're going to go to the slums right now and sort that out see if i can get some reap some money back and see you know if i could potentially try and break even with the two huge loans that i do have right now so we'll, we'll try and do this. This is going to be good, boys. I'm excited. So it's almost like four grand we'll lose in a month before we get everything rocking and rolling. So as soon as we pull up in the slums, we got issues for days. Are you just sent me the money? Okay, maybe not too many issues then. All right, get out of here. So start with Boring Lane then, the first property we ever had. And we're going to renovate this to make it a little bit more nicer. So... It's an A88, but we could make it a little bit nicer. So let's see, let's see. So first things first then, the 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 sound system. Right, well, let's scrap this. And we'll go with a the nicer. More expensive one. With a armchair for a gamer. With a, a royal a regal armchair. There we go. Uh, bathroom wise, we could improve the toilet. I forgot how awkwardly small this one was. Um, got the thing down there, the, um, the toilet brush. But we need a plunger. Okay, it's blocking the entrance there, so I put the plunger here. I'll get a new mirror on the wall above the sink. Nice. Um, got a TV in the kitchen. That's really good. We need. Let's get some some wall stuff. So, is that? Um, all right, let's get a poster up here. Oh, that's the oh, that's huge artwork. That there, so it was 88. Have I 
improved it by anything? 94! Okay, we'll do it. Begin open house! Let's get some serious cash for this place. Some serious cash. I could have improved the speakers thinking about it right now. Alright. Alright. Right, she's liking it. Exceptional. Negotiate! Alright, we're going big. We're going big. Come on. Your boy needs a new pair of shoes. Alright, let me accept that one. There we go, good stuff. So now we're technically losing 60,000. We're losing even more. Uh, have we had more people move move out? Oh, oh snap, okay. So all the properties in the slums are now free. Okay. So Ferry Street then we'll go to next. Now, Ferry Street, you could get some big money off this place. So, begin the renovation here, and let's see what we can do. So, straight away... Oh, actually, hang on. Let me, let me come off this quick. Leave. It is a 86. Right, so, straight away, get rid of the, um, the sofa. Put down the fancy one. If right, I put it right against the edge there, I then have the ability to squeeze in the... Little armchair, which is all good. Kitchen's pretty good. Like, I don't really got to do much with it. Bedroom-wise, I could squeeze in and add in if I move this above here so it's still in there. Uh, one of these puppies. There we go, just kind of freshen it up a bit. Um, sort out and sell the toilet. And we'll squeeze in the new one. There we go. Get in a plunger as well. And a towel rack, maybe? Bit high. <laughs> and a big, beautiful mirror. I like the star mirror. It looks pretty nice. So just by doing those minimalistic things there, from an 86 to a 95. Bigger than mud house. All right. Historically, you could get big money for Ferry Street. You could always get big money for Ferry Street. Yeah. So just waiting for someone to like really, really fall in love with it. Ugh. Come on, boys. All right. All right. Okay, he says it's good. Nice. Okay, is he gone too exceptional? He's on good. She's on fine. Let me see if we can get something else. Anybody else can squeeze anything out of him? Right, we'll just go good. Hang on, who, who makes the most money? Okay, oh, he's on fine. She's on good. Right, we'll, we'll negotiate with this dude. Oh, that's not looking like good money, to be honest with you. She's on good. Hmm. I always want you to get good money over here. Maybe my perception of good money's changed. Maybe. Maybe it has. Okay, we'll go with you. Good. It is what it is. So, come down. Maybe the market is not strong. Oh, I'm doing thingy, like, 30 days. Do you know what? That actually is not good money, is it? Maybe I've got it wrong. Maybe it's not Ferry Street that does bring them in the good money. But that is considerably low. I feel like it is. My right, beach road. Um. Who are you? <laughs> like, who are you? Do we have a, a square? 95. That's already pretty good. It, this I've actually recently done this, so I can't really add much to it. So I'll just begin the open house straight away. Oh, hold on. Sure, why not? So it's quite difficult for, for someone to fall in love with such a small place. Oh, I could have changed the shower. 
Okay, she's like fine. There is a random dude here. He he is he is also included in with the property. He is also included with the property, so Yeah. She really don't like it. You get out of here. Yeah. Right, you negotiate. There we go. Accept. Boom! Good stuff. So we have one more property right now, which is this one. Oh, is it Passyak Street? No, this oh no, this is the big one. So Passyak Street right now is 78. So there's definitely room for a lot of improvement in Passyak Street right now. And I think it all comes down to the freaking kitchen, doesn't it? Is the kitchen a little bit OTT from when we created it? I think it is. So we'll redo the kitchen. Uh, right now, furniture, kitchen, here we go. So we'll start with the sink in the corner just there. Actually, we'll put the sink in this corner, which means I can then place down... Oh, these are cabinet cabinets. Oh, that's annoying because we haven't unlocked the actual thing thing. Oh, this is so annoying. I haven't got all the um, the stuff unlocked, so I've got, like, different cabinets and whatnot now. What a shambles! But I can squeeze in some of these to kind of mimic it. Additional cabinets. Nice. <laughs> uh, oh, that's kind of annoying, but it is what it is, I suppose. Spin you round. All right, there's a couple more there. Well, no, I can put the table and chairs on this side, couldn't I? Yeah, that's what I'd do. So let me get in what I can in terms of, right now, appliances. I do need to get a refrigerator in, so I can't forget that. Spice rack, teapot, we've already got, got a toaster. I need a microwave. Where's the microwave's gone? Aha. So, refrigerator. You could argue I need a cooker hood. So maybe put this over on this side. All right, slightly off-centered, but you get the gist of it. It's quite a funky kitchen, that. It is quite a funky kitchen. But just roll with it, okay? Roll with it. Alright, nice big table. Right in the corner. Right, that should be good to go, right? Okay, you apparently can't set up this one. That's fine, right? Yeah. So, it was at 78, it's now at 75, so we've kind of redone the kitchen slightly, which is good, good for us. We'll get rid of this, and we'll squeeze in the armchair, as that little bit extra, little bit extra thrown in. I'll get rid of the weights and the dartboard, because they are like niche items. And then that leaves us at a 73. Uh, right, you know what? I'm going to waste too much time. Begin open house. Let's go. Let's just go right now. She loves it. Negotiate. <laughs> Make offer. Ooh. It could have been Passyak Street is one I was thinking about because we're going to get top dollar for this place. Right, accept current contract. Oh, offer. Oh, I did 30 days again. I always forget 120 days. It should default to 120 days. Well, it would have made sense, but in my head it does. Uh, right. So now I'm losing 7,500. From everything that I've just redone. And I feel like Ferry Street, there is something going on with this. Because this is, this is considerably low. 
I'm in my head. I'm thinking Ferry. There is something going wrong with Bro Ferry Street because I ain't getting that money anymore, am I? It is currently a 95 property. Maybe I just didn't get the right person in. Maybe I just didn't get the right person in. No one's really loving it, are they? Like a he does. I'll wait till he's exceptional. He's still good. It's like not big money. Fine. I'll right, ask her to leave. I think he's stuck because, like, well, I'm gonna ask him to leave. I need someone to be exceptional. Is what I need, isn't it? Good. Good. Fine. Why is no one becoming exceptional on this? There we go. Negotiate. Right, make offer. There we go. So it's not huge amounts of money. And I've done it 30 days again. Anybody else have these issues like like how I do? We've not getting the money just right. So the only person left right now. I mean, I feel like I'm getting wor not as much money as I once was. But the only person left that I haven't renovated their property. Let me just kind of sort all these people out. Right, is is this one. What he was just talking about right there. So if I skedaddle out of here back to the, the suburbs. I feel like, if anything, I've improved some of the properties. And yes, yeah, some of them have given me a little bit extra money. But I feel like I've not got as much money as before. Or is it truly down to that one where I did split it? Well, you know, I didn't do multiple tenancies. That could be it. But it's this property right now. Is the one? Oh no, this is the one we did. We did recently renovate. Oh yeah, because we only did thirty days, didn't we? What's happened? Okay, we failed the thingy. So we're getting like eight thousand for this. If I do rooms to rent instead, see how I can get out of it. He loves it. Negotiate. 120 days. Oh, snap. I could potentially get what I was just getting off from the one property. Make offer. Make offer. Accept that. Right. Sweet, mate. Uh, fine. Thinking. Unsatisfied. Good. Right. Ask her to leave. Come on. Fall in love again. Exceptional. Now, not as much money off this dude. But this should equal us to having more than that single tenancy before. So, we walk away with that one then. So, maybe it was a better idea to have two in there. We're now making... Damn. That's, that's profit-wise. So, it's this person over here in this property... That I then need to take a look at. So that's the one where I've. Oh my good! What has he done? Um. Bob. He hasn't told me what's going on with this place. Where is he? Bob, my boy. What's going on with your place right now? You 
He hasn't told anybody what's going on. Um. Right. Right, I broke his agreement. Begin the renovation. Damn, bub. The damn. Right, leave this. This is actually... It's actually an 83, so it's like... It's still not too shabby. I think what I'll do... I think what I'll do right now is... Um... Right, I got an idea. Real quick right now. So, if I get rid of the little room here... Right. Get rid of everything here in this bedroom. We then... Demolish this, this. Oh, oh no. Bank charges are going out. Oh no, I'm not going to have enough to pay that one. Um. Oh snap. Right, hold on. Right, this is actually... I'm panicking now. Right, this is not what I want to do. But I haven't got enough money to pay that bank thing. I might have to sell some of these antiques. Still not enough. Oh, I don't really want to get rid of that. Okay, hold on. Oh, this is painful. I got two of them. Right, how much is it? 70. Okay, I've got enough to pay that bank loan. Oh, but then they got enough to renovate. Oh, snap! Right, sell a couple of them bits and bobs. Uh, yeah, do the extension, please. I haven't collected my big boy money just yet. Oh, that's not really worth anything. Neither is that. Right, I have to get rid of this phantom. Oh, it's, I'm not even getting any good money for them. Right. Let's finish this off. So build. Because what my idea would is, is well was going to be... Uh, was that I, I split that wall there, do door just here. It makes no sense. And then throw in we've lost a tenant. What am I paying you for? It's all going wrong. It's all going wrong. Um, so yeah, I was going to squeeze a bed in. I should have enough right now to get, at least get these two beds. So if I throw one there. And I'll go for a double here. Just so I can get two tenants in above everything else. So not amazing. It puts us down to a 63. But I'm going to try and pull in two tenants. In the hopes of getting the money. Pause. I haven't got the money. I haven't got the money right now to pay that bank loan. Six months? No, because that'll bankrupt me. <laughs> oh, snap. Right, jobs. I need this person to have a reaction. Have a reaction! You didn't have enough to pay your monthly bank loan. Why did it take so long to have a reaction? Oh, I'm kind of annoyed. 
Uh, <sighs> we got debt collectors on our on us right now. Right, the bank. I've missed that loan multiple times as well, which is really annoying. Right. Oh yeah, I forgot. I'm having an open house review uh, finger here right now. Right, that person's thinking. That person's fell in love. Negotiate. Make offer. I ain't gonna get the money that I want. 120 days. Accept. You, fine. You, good. I'll send a pro in. I negotiate you. Accept wow. wow. right. that. Oh, it's a shambles. This, an absolute shambles. Okay, got them all in. Losing twelve thousand. Who was left? Boring lane. Oh yeah, because I only did um a couple of pennies for them. Oh my god. Amount due twenty one thousand. The money's gone up. No wonder I feel like I'm not making money. Guys Guys <laughs> This is what happens when you pay, don't pay your debts. This is what happens when you don't pay your debts. The bank wants more money. The bank wants even... They want 21000 off me for that one loan. It was 17000 They've added an extra four grand on top of it. Right, I've come here. Oh, no, hold on. Let me go back. Just so I can sort out that property in Boring Lane. I've now I was trying to break even and now it's all of a sudden gone to no Sunny, I can run an extra four grand off you. Right, please just fall in love with it and so I can just go back to doing jobs. I need to pay do you know what I need to do? Is pay off uh that hundred thousand dollar loan one. That is what I need to do. So you're fine, good. Fine. Exceptional, negotiate. Make off there. Yeah. I'll accept it. Skedaddle out of here. So pause then. Alright, just send me the money. Just send me the money. Get out of here. So I'm now officially losing eight grand. And that's all because I didn't pay that back that loan. So they've now demanded more money. On the next payment, I don't know whether it's now going to be twenty-one thousand for every payment. I don't know, but if I can pay off this loan by keep doing jobs, it will save me seven thousand a month. Seven thousand will then mean I am losing then one thousand seven hundred a month uh, with everything going on, which could potentially be if I sort out that one property where I just got two tenants in with the two bedrooms that I kind of did last minute. If I sorted out that correctly, I might be able to pull the money from that. Who knows? But guys, until next time, I'll see you all soon. So, good. Bye.